Hey, what's up guys? Sean from Revolutionary Fitness here. Real quickly, I wanted to go over the basics and how to um, put together a caster pack. So castor oil has numerous benefits. Um, you know, I'm not gonna go over all of them today. In this video, you can definitely check online though. There's tons of resources online and we'll link some stuff in the, the notes below. Um, but the primary reason that we promote caster packs is so that it can increase uh, gut health, increase digestion, um, bio production, liver health, and all that good stuff around your gut. So we're big proponents of the of the caster pack, and we use the caster pack in our 21 day uh, uh, Phoenix Reset Cleanse, a 21 day nutritional cleanse, which we'll link in the in the show notes below too. So these are the things that you need. Real basic. You need your castor oil. Now in terms of brand, you know I'm not promoting any particular brand. I just happen to have. The home health here not for any particular reason um, but you know find a castor oil that you like you need plastic wrap you need a ziploc bag i have the little small snack one doesn't really matter the size though and then you need wool flannel and this again just happens to be home health brand not promoting it I don't get paid to promote them um but uh i like their their wool flannel you can buy it in any health food market you know whole foods anything like that and then of course you need a scissor so the first thing you need to do is you need to cut a piece of the wool flannel um, somewhere like three to five inches in dimension. Um, so this is just an example of one that I pre-cut, right? So three to five, right? Three inches by five inches. It doesn't have to be, you know, uh, exactly like that, but this is a general rectangle size that you want. So what I do is then I take uh, the wool flannel, I place it in the Ziploc bag. Okay, so I just put it in there. Does it, again, doesn't matter how I, want, I put it in there. Then I take my castor oil and I actually just pour it in there on top of the wool flannel. And so what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to saturate the whole wool flannel in the castor oil. And you'll see too why we use the, the Ziploc bag. So that's pretty good. It's, again, oh, that one has a little hope. Not a particular science on this, but you just want to make sure you soak it. Okay, this is the way I was taught. There's different ways to do it. This is the way I was taught to do it. So you then, you know, smear it around, make sure that whole wool flannel is getting the castor oil. So I'm just playing around with it. Get my hand a little oiled up is okay. So now it's pretty good, right? So now I can apply it to my skin. I got some oil on me from the little leak. But the castor oil is good for everything. So I'll put it on my skin. The baby's running around. Get some on the baby too. All right. So where we place the caster pack is important. So, and the way I was taught is there's four quadrants that we want to hit around the stomach, around the gut area. So we use the belly button as a reference point. So this first uh, upper left, right? You're looking at me backwards, but this is the upper left in relation to my belly button is the first quadrant. So this is where I'm gonna put it on the first day. Then my lower left is the second, second quadrant. Then my lower right is the third, and then my upper right is the fourth quadrant. So it makes like a circle, okay? And so the way that we promote that you use caster packs, and again, there's different techniques out there, but is that we actually ask you to put it on for the whole night. So you place a caster pack in one quadrant, one section, and you wrap it with the plastic wrap. So basically, I would take my wool flannel, I would apply it, to the quadrant, right, using my belly buttons as a reference. And then I would take the plastic wrap and wrap my body. It's kind of annoying with the plastic wrap, but it's really the cheapest and best option. I've seen other options out there, um, but they're all really expensive, so the, the plastic wrap is really the best. But you put it on there for the whole night, and you just let it seek in. And all the oil is gonna saturate into your body, sink in through your skin, Different quadrants are gonna have different effects, right? When we're over here, we're hitting more of our stomach. As we get here, we're more in our intestines, small intestines. As we get over here, we're closer to our liver on the right side, and all of those things have benefits. But we ask you to hold it on for the whole night or a minimum of one hour, and then each night, you switch the quadrant. So you're in quadrant one the first night, then two the second, three the third, and the fourth day, you're on this, this uh, fourth quadrant. Once you hit all four quadrants, then you take three days of rest. So it's a four, three uh, rest cycle. So four days of cast or pack application, three days of rest. And you cycle through that as many times as you think you need. You could do it as an ongoing practice, 
or you can do it whenever you feel like you need to do some regeneration to your gut, your liver, and the health of that lower level. So I hope that helps. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. And if you have any ideas on alternatives to plastic wrap, and if you've seen anything on the market, also leave that in the comments below because we're always looking for other options. I hope that helps. Thanks.